News with Rick Semler and Sports. Welcome back. A high school boys basketball event that has become very popular is returning this coming season. The third annual Gobbler Games shootout are set for November 25th at Terre Haute South High School. You're watching some video from last year's game at Rose Holman. This eight game event is sponsored by Mossy Oak Properties, Ryan Lou State Farm, Sir Pro and York Automotive. Here's the rundown of the games that will start at 10 a.m. and run through 830 at night on November 25th at Terre Haute South High School. North Vermillion opens against West Vigo. The Vikings feature one of the better players in this and senior Zeke Tanus. Game 2, Owen Valley, South Vermillion, followed by Bloomfield Mitchell, then Mount Vernon Posey and North Central. The 4 p.m. game should be competitive between Northview and South Knox. The 530 game could be one of the best all day. 4A Evansville Harrison's pretty good. They take on a Park Heritage team that returns most of their squad that went to semi-state one season ago. Both Sullivan and Terre Haute South should be better this year. They meet at 7. The finale should be great. Terre Haute North, who's got a lot of talent, faces Evansville Christian and a D1 talent, Josiah Dunham. One of the organizers, Ryan Luce, says they really focused this year on bringing in an exciting day of basketball to the fans in the area. The turnover of some teams that are not exactly from the Wabash Valley brings uh, you know, some allure for local fans to see some teams from different parts of the state. We've got some Division I players that are coming in. I think uh, the, on the individual aspect, it, it creates excitement for our event. Our games, uh, ultra competitive. We try to match them up as fairly as possible. That way we can get a good show for all the fans that come down. And I think Tarot South is going to be the place to be the Saturday after Thanksgiving.